First we will start by assembling the electrode stand. To assemble the stand we will insert the bottom part of the stand in the cutout of circular base of the stand. After inserting the stand in the cutout of circular base, rotate the stand clockwise to lock the stand in place. On the back side of the pH meter we have a socket for pH electrode, temperature probe and USB connection each. Now we will see how to connect temperature probe to the pH meter. First we will put the temperature probe in the stand. Now we will connect the temperature probe to the temp socket in the pH meter. Now we will connect the pH electrode to the pH meter. There is a BNC connector at the end of the pH electrode to connect the pH electrode to the pH meter. Plug the electrode BNC connector on the pH meter BNC socket. Now we will take the pH electrode out of the storage solution bottle by gently pulling out the electrode from the bottle. Now we will wash the pH electrode and temperature probe with distilled water and wipe them off with a tissue paper. Now we will turn on the pH meter with the button on the right of the pH meter. After turning on the pH meter we will press the PRG button and the main menu will appear, then we will select the calibrate option by using the arrow buttons on the pH meter, then we will select the pH option given on the screen. We can navigate through the options with the help of arrow buttons on the pH meter. On the next screen points refers to amount of buffers we will use to calibrate the pH meter. Right now we have three buffers we want to use to calibrate the pH meter, so we will select three points option on the screen. On the next option screen we will select manual as we want to manually calibrate the pH meter. After that we will take our first buffer, that is 7.00 buffer and insert the electrode and the temperature probe into the buffer solution. New readings will appear on the screen and the first digit will start blinking which indicates we can adjust the number of the current digit. As our buffer solution is of 7 pH we will skip the tens digit by pressing enter button once. Caution do not double press the enter button on one digit as IT will trigger the next digit without adjusting the reading we want. As our pH buffer is of 7 pH we will also skip the ones digit in our case as our pH meter is showing the correct number. Now to adjust the reading to match the pH of our buffer solution we will use the arrow button to adjust the blinking digit and take it to zero. After pressing enter last digit will start blinking and we will adjust it to the reading of the pH buffer solution accordingly. Your calibration for first buffer solution has been completed. Now we will wash the pH electrode and temperature probe with distilled water and wipe them off with a tissue. Now we will take our next buffer solution that is 4.00 pH and insert the electrode and temperature probe into the buffer solution. After inserting the pH electrode and temperature probe into the buffer solution we will press enter as directed on the screen. Similarly as the first calibration the tens digit will start blinking, indicating it can be adjusted and as our pH buffer is a 4 pH we will skip the tens and ones digit by pressing enter button as they match with the pH of the buffer solution. Again we will adjust the tenths and hundredths digit to match the pH of our pH meter with the help of arrow buttons. 
Again we will take the pH electrode and temperature probe out of the buffer solution and wash and wipe them with distilled water and tissue. Next we will take our third buffer solution that is 9.20 pH and insert the pH electrode and temperature probe into the buffer solution, press enter as indicated on the screen and repeat the process used in previous calibrations, similarly as the first calibration the tens digit will start blinking indicating it can be adjusted and as our pH buffer is of 9.20 pH we will skip the tens and ones digits by pressing enter button as they match with the pH of the buffer solution, again we will adjust the number to match the pH of the buffer solution and press enter to adjust the next digit. Your pH meter calibration has been completed. To navigate back to home screen we will press PRG button 4 times. Now we can start taking reading with our pH meter. Thank you.